Hello everyone. Let's deal with this very quickly. We have 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x equals 100. And um, before I proceed, if you're new to this channel, subscribe so that you can get more videos like this. And um, equally share this to your friends so that um, they can benefit as well. We have 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x. By the way, we have the same thing, right? So we can factorize 5 to the power of x. So that here we have one left. And there again we have another one. If I open this bracket, I will have the same thing back. So this is equal to 100. Now what do I do? This is 5 to the power of x multiplied by 2 equals 100. 1 plus 1 is 2. Since we are multiplying, we can divide by 2. This will go with this. Now we have 5 to the power of x to be equal to 50. 50 divided by 2 is 50. Um, 100 divided by 2 is 50. But then we cannot express 50 in this form. So what do we do? We take the log of both sides. But you should be able to know that 50 can be written as 5 times 10. Okay. And by the way, I can still work on that as I get 5 to the power of x equals 5 times 5, then times 2. Because 10 is still 5 times 5, right? So, to continue, then we can have 5 to the power of x equals 5 to the power of 2 multiplied by 2. Now, mind you, we can now take the log of both sides. So we have log 5 to the power of x equals log open bracket 5 squared times 2. And now we're going to apply one of the laws of um, logarithm very quickly. The law says that if you have log a times b, it is the same thing as log a plus log b. So I will apply the same thing here. So we have log 5 to the power of x equals log 5 squared then plus log 2. Now there's something else that would do because there's another law of logarithm that says powers can always go behind. So in this case, the power here is x. It goes behind, so we have x log 5. Then 2 here is a power. We have 2 log 5, then plus log 2. Now, what do we do? We can divide both sides or divide all through by log 5, since we want to make x the subject. Divide this by log 5. Then divide this by log of 5. This is going to go, this will go with this. So that we get x to be equal to 2. Here we have 2, then plus log 2 over log 5. Log 2 over log 5. By the way, we can apply change of base. Because log a over log b is the same thing as log a to base b. And this is because both of them have the same base. So I apply the same thing here as I will be having x equals 2 plus log 2 to base 5. So here we have the value of x. But if you want to press your calculator, you will get the value of x in decimal form. What do I do? Let us verify. Okay, so this is the value of x that we have. And um, we have 5x plus 5x equals 100 as the original equation. 
and um, before we proceed you should be able to know that if we put this together we have 2 of 5 to the power of x and this is equal to 100 okay like i did before you know we can divide this and divide this this will go so that we have 5x to be equal to 50. now let's put in the value of x into this what i have done is to reduce the equation from this form to this form to this particular form so that it will be simpler and easier for us to verify now we have 5 to the power of 2 plus log 2 to base 5 this 2 is not a power do you think this will be equal to 50 that's what we want to verify now there's a law we want to up, um, apply to this if you have um, a to the power of b plus c this is the same thing as a to the power of b multiplied by a to the power of c because if the bases are the same you pick one and add the powers that's what they did to this to get this right now i'm going to apply the same thing there so that we have 5 to the power of 2 multiply by 5 to the power of log 2 to base 5 now will this be equal to 50 let's keep going now 5 to the power of 2 will give us 25 so we write 25 here then multiply by 5 to the power of log 2 to base 5 now log to base 5 will cancel this base number so this and this will go so we'll just have this to multiply by 2 and 25 times 2 will give us 50 i know this part may confuse some persons this particular part downward okay so what i'm saying is this this 5 squared is 25 then remember we had 5 to the power of 2 of log 2 to base 5 now since this is the base and this has this the whole of this as the power therefore this log to base 5 and this number here will cancel each other if they are the same so whatever you have here will multiply 2 okay so we have this 5 squared times 2 which will give us 50 now this is what i'm trying to say that if you have a to the power of log b to base a this and this will cancel and this is equal to b okay so this will be equal to b and that's what i did to this part now this is to confirm or by the way we have confirmed or verified that x is equal to 2 plus log 2 to base 5 thank you for watching to the end and um subscribe to my channel